Well, a very warm welcome to you on this most pleasantly clear evening. Conditions absolutely beautiful, perfect for the beautiful game. Temperatures are kind as well, no doubt playing a hand in high attendance levels as well as an elevated level of anticipation here. Surely this is the hot ticket going around in this neck of the woods. It surely must be. And we have in front of us this gloriously imposing arena, absolutely picture-perfect for a game of this nature. Verona have chosen to go with a 3-6-1 formation here. Well, what tends to happen with a, a puzzling-looking formation like this is that two of the more creative midfielders take up slightly inverted attacking roles to make it a, a simpler 3-4-3 setup or indeed 3-4-2-1 that's what should unfold here at the moment I admit it does look a little strange so we're up and running Josip Ilicic Daron. Daron plays it forward. He's had a goal! Goal! It's hardly a surprise, is it? That's what we're here for. A player with this wonderful knack of being able to show up and deliver at important times. Yet, yet another example. With time and space are plenty, he was never going to miss. Yeah, and all engineered, Peter, by some smart running and movement. That's already something to admire, but how about the pass? Just wonderful. Loved it. Atalanta go ahead, one goal to the good. Gets the power of his man. Great challenge, time to perfection. Aritza Pata. It's compared to a promising move. Hoists it forward. to throw he gets past his man more than happy to take the muscular approach well the crowd clearly like what they just saw some real no-nonsense defending oh, well intercepted really alert to the danger this was gone, that's a foul. Ilicic! It's anyone's ball. Great strength, too strong for his opponent, and they've been caught out here. And that's a goal kick. Looking for space out wide, going through. Decent ball. Is there any support? He might not need it. Atalanta are playing with a pleasing width here, especially that front line. Is it working for you? Um, it's not movement for the sake of it. Um, yes, it is working for me. There's a purpose to, to create space. And he's there to cut it out. The room. 
Josip Ilicic. Hatterbor. Josip Ilicic. Zapata. Played into the middle. That intervention was very necessary. And we've reached half time. So there you have it, a close fought half of football. But like it still had its moments, but ultimately produced just one goal. A more than decent game up to now. Well, it hasn't exactly got the plan so far, but there's no need to panic. There's still plenty of time to get back into this. As always, an early goal would help swing things back in their favour. And the game has already resumed here. Verona need to get... Uh, looks a foul. Yep, referee's given it. Looks to clip it forward. And it's Simeone. That a foul? Yes, the uh, referee's given it. And here's Simeone. Oh, some tackle that. Some excellent tackling here, and that one a perfect example. Oh, shooting chance! Oh, just lacked a decent finish. Verona really have been deserted by their composure and allowed frustration to take over, and it's not a good sign. Your impression so far, Jim? Well, the time has arrived to start taking risks. They may well be happy just to level this. Hatterbor. Daroon. Can't get the better of his opposite number. Cuts it out. One way of trying to make things happen. There's a few who could follow that example. Atalanta are clearly looking to kill this game off. It's keeping the ball away from the other end, too. Yeah, it's pretty obvious as to who is going to be taken off. His energy levels began to, to sag and he was never going to last until the final whistle. And it's Simeone. Away from immediate danger, gets it back. The leveller or the knockout blow, either way, it's got to happen right away. At least they're going about it as they should, having brought this on themselves. It over to the other flank. The room. Forward it goes. And once more they can't get through. And here's Zapata. Out to the right. Now it's Zapata. That's a pop! It 
time is up, and there goes the whistle. So it ends 1-0, an enthralling game and an agonisingly narrow defeat. So what do you take away from it all, Jim? It's just a bad day at the office, Peter. They look...